What are mala beads and how to use them? Hey there, beautiful souls. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of mala beads. You might have seen them adorning the wrists of your favorite yogi or even as a trendy accessory. But what exactly are mala beads and what makes them so special? In this video, we'll explore their history, meaning, and how to use them in your meditation practice. So let's get started. The Origins of Mala Beads Mala beads have been around for thousands of years, dating back to ancient India. They're deeply rooted in Hinduism and Buddhism, and have long been used in prayer and meditation practices. The word mala itself comes from the Sanskrit word for garland. Now, let's get into the nitty-gritty of what makes these beads so unique. Components and Design of Mala Beads a traditional mala necklace consists of 108 beads, a guru bead, and a tassel. You might be wondering, why 108? Well, the number 108 holds significant spiritual and symbolic meaning in various Eastern traditions. Mala beads can be made from a variety of materials like wood, seeds, gemstones, or even crystals, each carrying its own energy and purpose. The spiritual and symbolic meaning of mala beads Mala beads are more than just pretty accessories, they're powerful spiritual tools. They're commonly used for japa meditation, which involves reciting mantras and help practitioners maintain focus and intention. Different cultures also attribute various symbolic meanings to mala beads, enriching their spiritual significance. So the next time you see someone wearing mala beads, remember, there's more to them than meets the eye. Modern Uses and Benefits of Mala Beads Nowadays, mala beads are not only popular in spiritual circles, but have also become fashionable accessories. They're known for promoting stress relief and grounding, making them perfect companions for our fast-paced lives. So, how do you choose the right mala beads for you? It's all about connecting with the energy and materials that resonate with your personal journey. How to use mala beads for meditation ready to incorporate mala beads into your meditation practice. Let me show you how. Hold the mala in your dominant hand, starting with the bead next to the guru bead. As you recite your chosen mantra, move through the beads one by one. Experiment with different mantras and find what works best for you. And remember, there's no right or wrong way to use your mala beads, it's all about your personal connection with them. In conclusion, Mala beads are not only gorgeous accessories, but also powerful tools for meditation and spiritual growth. I hope you've enjoyed learning about their history and significance. Please click subscribes for more inspiring content and tips on incorporating spirituality into your daily life. Thanks for watching and until next time, stay mindful, stay connected, and keep shining your light.